Hello guys, I'm Rodney and this Q&A video should prove to be extremely interesting because it is about the best gaming mice for November 2015. Now I know some of you are probably going to be wondering, well why didn't you include this mouse or that mouse? And that mouse isn't really the best mouse that's currently on the market for gaming. Well, you know what? That's the great thing about this whole setup, isn't it? On YouTube you can comment and you can post what you think is the best gaming mouse. And speaking of that I'm running a poll on this particular topic at the same time I'm releasing this Q&A video and I will post that link above if you want to go over and vote so let's get to it okay so I'm not going to tease you here and start with number 10 and work my way up to the number one mouse as a matter of fact I'm not really going to do any kind of numbering with this I'm just going to rant and go on and get maybe a little bit distracted talking about what I think are some of the best gaming mice that are currently out there. Now this thing just rotating and spinning here on the screen looking so gorgeous is the Logitech G502 mouse. And it is just an exceptional overall mouse. Awesome sensor, beautiful looks, lots of buttons, and very important, it has an awesome feel to it. Now I have medium sized hands from the tip of my finger to the end of my palm, around seven and a half or eight inches. So I have medium sized hands. Um, and if you remember the MX518, this is the replacement really to that. If you like that, I think you will like this particular mouse. Now this is $100, fairly expensive. However, this is a pro gaming mouse. So expect to pay that kind of money. But if you want to save a few dollars, you might want to go with the Logitech G402 mouse. Similar kind of setup, but you're saving, you know, 20 bucks. And to be honest, I mean, if you're spending a hundred bucks, if you're all oh, you're thinking about spending a hundred dollars, and that I mean, 80 bucks and a hundred bucks, yeah, I I would probably opt to go for the 502 g502 unless of course you can get this one on special or you know maybe you can get this one on special as well who knows but uh there you go that's an option as well now if you want to go even cheaper than that and go with something super basic and simple well not really basic and simple i guess but kind of the logitech g400 s is an excellent mouse so next up is the razor death adder now this is the chroma but the death adder has it's been revised and revised and revised right there's, there's a few death adders that are out there and all of them for the most part have been you know really good and they've gone over extremely well so this is definitely an option now the next few mice well they're shaped pretty much almost identical the zowie Mice, they have an FK1 and an FK2, but look at the overall styling on them. Excellent. You have the the Rocket Cone XTD and the Rocket Cone Pure. Two excellent mice. Can't go wrong with those. And Steel Series has a couple, the Sensei and the Sensei Raw. So to recap, these are some of the best gaming mice for 2015. The Logitech G502 with a G402, the Razer Death Adder Chroma, the Zowie FK1, FK2, the Rocket Cone XTD Pure, as well as the SteelSeries Sensei or Sensei Raw. But also really worth mentioning is the Logitech G602 and the Corsair M45. So those are my picks, agree or disagree, and also a reminder to vote on the poll. I'll provide a link to that above as well if you think this video and other videos that i do are great like them and subscribe to the channel and as always your comments are welcome and if you have a question for me go ahead and post it and i'll try to answer it as soon as i can